Thank you so much for joining me as Game Edge. We're testing out This Land Is My Land, a game that was sent to me by developers, which I've been looking forward to play. I've seen all the videos of it. I've seen all the pictures of it. And thank you, developers, for letting me make a video, of course, to bring this to you guys and to showcase it. Again, if you're interested, a link will be in the description field for you guys to pre-order this game. It is awesome. An open-world stealth action game with a living, hostile environment, which evolves over time, independently from player actions. There's some enemies in here, and of course they're quite intelligent, and they'll be building themselves out. From what I've heard, there's forts that we built. The settlers will go in and start taking up our land, and it's going to be very difficult, this game. I'm not going to lie to you guys. From what I've heard, it is extremely difficult, and I've not played it yet. We're going to jump in and test it out ourselves. Again, if you like it, take time, hit the like button. If you're brand new, make sure you subscribe. Always very much appreciated. All right, let's jump in here. All right, so if I type in Game Edge itself, I'm going to get minus 170 stamina. So I decided to go to Pontiac itself, and I think we get three warriors. There we go. And if you guys are not aware, uh, Chief Pontiac is well known uh, in his defense of the Great Lake regions of the U.S. and British troops invasion and occupation in 1763. Pontiac uh, with 300 followers attempt to take Fort Detroit by surprise. So I thought, you know what, I decided what the heck, I'll type that in, and it did work out really nicely. We got ourselves three extra warriors of that. Let's jump in and see what happens. Again, if, wow, I'm really excited for this. All right, here we go. His camp is located. All right, now I got pick from here. His camp is located, uh, okay, quite far from the frontier. Prefers to grow. I think we're going to go normal start, because if you're right in the middle of the nest itself, that seems like a little bit of a killer for a first time playing this game. I need a little bit of time. All right, so we're going to be pretty far away from any kind of, I guess, local areas that I'm going to be settling in. All right, here comes a horse. I get early, early access. I mean, wow, this is amazing. Resistance of Pontiac began. Oh, shit. Oh my god, that's awesome. Alright, so here we are. We arrive, and uh, yeah, we're at our camp currently. Recently, rescued warrior told me that the person which is responsible for all these massacres, which led to the almost complete disappearance of our people on that land, stays in one of the camps nearby. I need to find him to make him pay for all the pain and the suffering which caused us. Yeah, that's right, no kidding. This land will be mine. Alright, so top bar is supposedly, if you can see a little bit top bar, I think we're going to see whether there's a shift of that. This is our actual, uh, where things are. We can put them marks, our compass. All right, W-S-A-D, move. Space is for roll. Hold left shift to sprint and roll. Okay, nice. And uh, C is to change stance, sneak, and, of course, Q to switch camera. All right, nice. Let's switch camera. Nice, all right. Crouch and sneak. Really sneaky. If we hold it, we can really crouch down on that. Nice. Very, very cool. Nice. And then we try to roll and run. Ooh, cool. All right, we need to make ourselves a wooden bow and arrow. This is our... Oh, wow. Look at this. Oh, it looks so cool. Horses and stuff. Uh, those are our people right there that are uh, well, in our village currently, our warriors. And we're going to pick up some stuff we're going to need here. Oh, they got access uh, skills. There's a couple of skills you can, so you can... Uh, okay. With G. Use with G. Hold G while others are passive and needs and selected. All right, let's see. This is hold down. Let's see if we can get that. Lure enemy. Emit and coyote sound to attract enemies. Smoke herbs. All right. Interesting. And throw stones. All right, so we have a couple of things we can do there. Uh, I believe there's flax here we need to pick up. And we also need to find some wood. We need to craft ourselves up. So there's a whole crafting menu. Oh, they're going to go through here. Click on a uh, quick access icon on top of the map. And click on map icon directly on the map. All right. On top of a camp related uh, activate button. So there's buttons here on the side. Attack, gather, settle, and another camp. On the bottom, you'll find a list of available camps. If you're inside one of the posts and camps and close outposts, you'll be able to take items from the selected camps. All right, this is, must be like this here. You can tribe, can gather resources and craft items. Click add stock or, uh, order button to access. Oh my God, it goes quick. 
Let me slow down a bit. Here comes in which you can uh, tribes can gather or craft. Only items in which belong to biomes where camps is look. Oh Jesus! Please don't. <laughs> I'm not clicking this in tribes and animals. Gee, that's too fast for me. Only can craft items and recipes in which you know. All right. When the warriors are doing orders, you appeal uh, are able to quickly find uh, them in a map by pressing something. In inventory. All right. I guess we'll learn on the fly. Uh, I wish I can uh, figure that out a little bit faster, but it seems a little bit too fast for me. All right. We'll see here. We have a craft itself. Uh, we can also do known what we do know. Only the stuff we do know we can craft up here. And of course, our bow and stuff here, so we can see all the stuff. The SP here, which is on top right, we'll get some SP, I guess, from hunting and other things, and maybe taking out the enemy itself. We'll get to be able to make it some more and learn how to make these. And for now, we don't want to make a wooden bow and some arrows. Now, that being said, we do have a couple of them, so we're going to make ourselves a bow. We have currently some wood. We'll craft one of those. I guess we start off with a little bit. And some arrows, which we have five wood. We need five wood for that. So we have a stack of five arrows currently. While you can track only uh, one objective, there's maybe uh, may, may many and switch currently tracked. All right, so we have to do some tracking objectives here. Increase power, convince uh, Tadera leaders to join your fight. Kill for uh, Fort Utah leader. Oh, crap. All right, 3,000. I bet you that's freaking hard. We're going to track this one and try and get some help. I don't know where that is currently on a map, but we'll find out that very shortly. All right, cool. Nightfall. I guess we're going to pick up some stuff here, too. We're going to need... I'm going to need more sticks and stuff, so we're going to have to find those little nimble trees. I don't know if I see any... Oh, look at this. You can uh, oh, initiate fast travel from the nearest outpost while a campfire outpost a camp within the region. Light up the outpost campfire. Enable travel from it. Oh, cool. We have a little fast travel. That is pretty sweet. Now, from what I heard while I was reading on when it was first started, uh, they said that uh, you can't die. You get knocked down. You lose some uh, some SP points. So, yeah, we're going to have to be careful. Your guy will come back to life, and it will continue growing as they go through it. We don't lose any points, and you also lose everything you have on you. So we'll pick up uh, some of the stuff we can see right here. I'm also looking for branches and stuff. Oh, what's this? Right, this must be what they're talking about. Hold to la light campfire. And switch between bow, pistol, and rifle. Hold and change active. All right, cool. All right, we could like this. We can rest if we want to. And, uh, yeah, okay, so we're right here next to the outpost. We can leave that open. Let's see here. We have crafting, inventory, skills. We still have to learn our skills. Well, let's try this out. So if I hold this down, I can select, if I had multiple weapons, I guess I can select that. Beautiful. Two, we have nothing there. Three, there's nothing. And four, I have other kinds of mushrooms and stuff I've picked up. We also have this here, which is minus 50 health. I don't know what we'd use that for. But I guess we can craft up. Maybe it's for poisons to get animals. I have no idea. Or maybe locals that uh, that have now come in. I hold four uh, to access usable items and potions and traps. Yeah, we just did that. All right, a little ahead of you. Just a tiny bit. I'll pick up the mushrooms. I don't know how important these are, but they seem to be everywhere. But I definitely want to pick up a tiny bit of stuff here. What's this? Is there anything else? No, just rocks. I thought we could pick up rocks too. No, we cannot. Okay, I cannot find too much trees and stuff we can use. I don't know if they spawn and spawn back out when. I don't think we need to sleep or anything like that. We can sleep tonight from what I've seen there. Rest. Tab uh, to access inventory, craft objects, and... Okay, let's see here. Social. Uh, please note that the retrieve from the socials may lost. I have no idea. Shared SP. I, I share some, I guess, with people. Skills himself. These are the things we're going to unlock itself. Uh, bow accuracy. You can get it with two of us. So 750. We got 150. I'm not sure why. And we are crafting many, of course, in inventory, current inventory. And we also have our town here, which, if not mistaken, clack on this. And we have our stuff. We can settle, set up a new camp, which means I can put up a new camp here if I want to increase the size. Drink water, forest. This is another enemy camp, I guess, currently. We're going to have to try and get together, I guess, with these guys. Uh, we can also do gather, send warriors to gather resources, which is probably important for us to do. 
And I also add camp inventory requirements. All right, let's see here. I want to get some wooden arrows. We should have at least... Uh, what's this? Warriors themselves. No, one second. Let's do this here. I want wooden arrows. And it's sending warriors. One second. Let's cancel this out. I think it's flipping back and forth. Through. And it gets early access, so it's not unusual. It's going to happen. Now let's go with uh, let's go with fifty or sixty. Let's do sixty for this. We're going to need sixty arrows. So I don't know if these guys can do that. Let's do fifty actually. Confirm. And I also want to add some bows for our guys. We're going to need some of those. Did I miss it? I must have missed it. It's on top here. Okay, wooden arrows, wooden bow, right in front of it. Nice. Let's get select items ordered, already ordered. Wooden arrows. Oh. Bow. Nice. Wooden bow. All right, we don't need that many. We're going to get, uh, do 50 of those. All right, so we got bows in that. This will be uh, low quality bows currently, it says. And I guess that's going to be a big problem for us to kind of get through. We're going to also gather, which we're telling our camp right now all this. We can send out warriors to do that. We have three warriors currently. And we want them to go and get some wood for sure. I'll try and get some flax and stuff since it just seems to be really easy. There's stone too. I guess we can pick up stone. All right, wood. We're going to want that. Select items already ordered. No, I didn't want bow. Am I getting confused here? What the hell this is? Why is it doing this? All right, wood. There we go. I think the other menu pops up after a while. It might be something they need to fix. All right, so that's good. So you'll see your warriors. They should spread out in the daytime and start hanging back out, I guess. Uh, right now, we have that ordered them to do. Gathering. Curly. And it says warrior gathered flax. Warrior wood, wood, wood. So they're gathering some stuff as is already. Maybe it's just local around the area. Or we have stuff like this. Well, close enough friendly. Camp outpost and campfire. Absolutely fast travel. We went through that. I wonder if we can ride those horses. I think we can. All right. I really need wood. And each biome has their own thing. Oh, shit. A camp. That does not look like it's friendly. But there's an, it looks like it's abandoned, actually. Let's go and check out the sea. Let's loot this baby up. We got some medicine. Uh, 54 caliber load. Some Boda bags. Which is what? Minus 10 health. Whiskey, minus 50 health. We gotta be careful. Interesting. Nice. Please note the save game feature. Yeah, we'll have to make sure we save it. Absolutely. Loot is empty, it says. So it's all one big bit. Uh, yep, the whole area here. So I guess we can find these things around abandoned camps where people have been killed. We're a little bit further out than I'd like to. I am playing the night part of it. It's where they started me off, so might as well. I hear animals. I know we can hunt in this game. Definitely footsteps and stuff. It doesn't sound like wolves or anything. Uh, can I pick up rocks? Oh, what is it? Change side camera, absolutely. All right, we'll just do that to make it feel better. Pressing E holds that down. Gotcha. What the hell is that? Death caps. There's something coming closer. Should probably start heading back to my base. Let's open up this. What we're gonna do is we're gonna put a click on here. Right click supposedly goes right there. You see a little space. Nice. A little square that comes in and shows up in our top compass. Alright, I think I got a lot of you guys. I don't know if you need them or not. I just figured it's shite if I can pick it up right now. I don't want to go and find them afterwards. There's some more mushrooms there. Alright, let's start looking for sticks. That's really what we need. Small little trees from what I heard. There's some deer right there. I don't have enough arrows to take them down. And it's probably easier with a horse anyways. I'm not seeing any trees. Are these guys like gathering all this stuff for me? We could go back to the camp and utilize anything they gather. Nice little flip over. Any rocks and stuff I can carry? No. I did say I can pick up rocks and other things, so that's interesting. We'll see how that works out. I'm not seeing too many of those trees, dudes. Oh, there's one here. Little hickory. Beautiful. Smoked hickory. 
All right, we got a couple more sticks. So that means we just need a few more of those. I'm not sure how much it gives us. I didn't see it and look at it very closely. I'll have to do that afterwards. I'm going to drop off some of the loot we have in here. Of course, we have inventory. If we get too heavy, we won't be able to run it. We also have a stamina bar down below. And we just be careful. Uh, right there is our base. I can see the fires. All right, cool. Just going to do a little bit of surrounding here. There's a deer right there, dude. Can I craft this up? Give me some more arrows right away. I can't. I need more wood. It's only got one. I don't know if I can get him. Wow. That's a pretty good shot. I don't know if we get the arrows back or not. Yeah, the headshots are really good. Okay, let's pick this up. Two meat and some sinew. I don't see any arrows. So we do lose our arrows. Yep. We've got one arrow left, which is a big problem. Hopefully the uh, fine people have gone back out. Yeah, they're gathering right now. You see they're here. So he's gathering wood. He's got three on him already. Right over here, they got three wood. He's doing a better, they're doing a much better job than we are at finding wood. There is some. I wish I were a little more clustered. Oh, there you go. As I said it. Look around, game. I should look around. I guess it's something to get used to at finding it. That's all. That's it. That's all. Like everything. All right. I think we can craft up. No, we're still one shy. One shy to get a couple more. There's a deer right there just staring, looking at me, going, Did you kill my girls? A doe? A deer? I did kill the deer. A female deer. Buddy. All right. Let's head back in. Hopefully we'll find a couple, one more stick here. If not, there's probably some inside the camp itself. Um, they're supposed to be doing a job going out and about. Now, if you keep your warriors in, in check here, they're armed and stuff. You can let them protect your land here from bear attacks. They can come rolling in from what I was hearing. So that'll be interesting for us to see. And then also the settlers and stuff, which we're going to have to attack. All right, we'll get some more flax. I know that comes important for making more bows. Which I think we should make a, probably a second bow anyways. Since the quality doesn't seem to be that high. I guess we're getting better. That's a fire we created there, if you guys are wondering. I don't think we can get that one. It's in a rock. Yeah, it's kind of inside there. Is that a stick up here? Or are you just happy to see me? Nope. No sticks. It's my imagination. Yeah, it's be a little further away for some of this pickup. How about this? Can we pick up this little tree? No. And I wonder if we can do axes and stuff. Which means we can pick up and uh, axes. But we're going to utilize a knight for gathering as much as we possibly can. And since it seems to be pretty tranquil where we started off, it gives us a chance to kind of look around and uh, search a tiny bit. There's a deer, I guess. I hear some walking. Oh, damn. Wasn't too sure there for a second. I kind of held my breath going, is it a deer? I don't have any more arrows. Now you can. Let's craft that baby up. And we get five arrows for that. Right? Yeah, so now we have six total. Sweet. Right, let's go back to camp see if they gathered some stuff up for us. We don't need to do this all the time. We should have our, our village out there and about doing the work for gathering as much as they possibly can. We'll try and drop off the flax and stuff we got. We'll make ourselves another bow if we can grab a little more wood. I'll show you guys how to do that. I'm hoping I got it right. Again, uh, just learning on as we go on a fly. Or, uh, yeah, our guy is a little bit tired. Just a tiny bit. Oh, there is a basket. So empty. Not so good. All right, well, we can put some stuff in here. We're going to keep the medicine, the boat itself, uh, which is, we'll put that inside our, our inventory here. Uh, 75 stamina, 10 max stamina, 30 seconds. We're going to keep the medicine, though. That's pretty cool. Whiskey. I'm not going to need that. I don't know if we could trade or anything yet. As it is early inside the game. Uh, this is definitely poison. It even gives you a little poison sign right there. Put, 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 put. Okay, I got the shift click. Right? That's it. Shift click. You can do it. Um, some sinew and uh, meat. I'm going to try and keep the sinew on me and see what we can do with that. And craft. Let's see if we get points for crafting. Weird stuff. All right. So let's craft this up, which is Buckworth Tea. 
we don't get any points for that, do we? There we go. I shift clicked it to get all of it. Let's try and see if we can get more. A black tonic. I don't know. It's not giving me any extra points, is it? I was hoping we'd get some of that. We can also craft up rope with flax itself. That's pretty sweet. And look at us on top here. My land, 4.1% that they aren't, they, uh, well, it's been taken over. We're going to have to fight that back. All right, we need arrows and stuff. I'm hoping the uh, fine people are going to be going back out and doing the work they're supposed to be doing and grabbing some of the loot. Yeah, we have seven wood here. And you saw how hard it is. So it's going to be hard for them to go out and about doing the same thing. Daylight is coming. And I'm going to see whether we're going to take a horse today. That'd be pretty cool. We're going to put this in here too. Saxon Navy pistol. Maybe we should keep that on us. How much weight is that? I don't know. Where's our weight? Because I see inventory. I don't know how we can be encumbered or not. If it does show you health, stamina, weight. There it is. 15.6 of 40. Gotcha. All right. Let's put that in there. 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 We're going to keep that. I didn't see anything with sinew yet. So we're going to put that in there. Maybe they can craft something with that. Good stuff. All right, uh, flax and rope. And there we go, some wood for now. We have a couple of arrows. Hopefully they come back and we can grab a tiny bit more. Let's go and grab a little more flax and stuff, which seems like it would be very helpful. I don't think mushrooms are that helpful for us. And then we're going to try out the horse and see if we can go out and about to, to see what we can do. Now, from what I've heard, uh, be careful when you're going back out to, if I'm not mistaken, we have to liberate those people um, from what I was reading. So it's going to be kind of tough for us to do and we're gonna need a lot more arrows and stuff for that before we can get that going we could kind of just kind of ride around and see if we can find anything else lucky looks like a lot of resources around us i don't know if it respawns or not so kind of keeping an eye out for anything that may have respawned back expanding its borders fort to oh look at they're growing shite all right, so all these are growing right now, these forts. Oh, she's right next to us. Fort Hamilton. So these guys here are expanding back out. we got to be careful of this. Uh, drink water for us. I don't know if these are our friends or not or something we're going to have to look at. I don't know, but they're 6.7%, dude. We're going to have to get a move on. And when we load it into the... It's right that they, because they get more of their stuff so I don't, from, uh, I think, trains? I don't know what it is. If they get their deliveries, so maybe wagon... I don't think the trains are out and about here. Again, limited knowledge, but we're going to learn as we go. If you guys see more sticks, please uh, holler it out. We need to get some meat and stuff, which is pretty cool. I don't know how to cook that. I guess I have to tell them to cook it. Kind of something we'll have to do. Um, all right, let's go around here for one last shot. Hopefully find about five more sticks. It would be nice in this part of the forest. A lot of trees, but darn None of those ones with sticks, even on the ground. Maybe something good if it's seen some of this stuff like on the ground itself. Maybe it is on the ground, but I don't see any. Even these bushes here, if we can take them apart, will be kind of nice. Let's see whether I can grab that. Is this where we were before? I'm going to see in a second anyways. If this is another place. Yeah, loot empty. We did this place already. Easy to fall back in the same trail, I guess. Yeah, not see anything here. No sticks, no nothing. All right, well... We can maybe go out on a horse and test it out. I wonder if we can grab it. My stamina is tanked again. And where's our guys right now? Are they back in yet? I think they are. Inventory itself. Uh, we can click on this. I think we can see the inventory they have total. Meat, sinew, flax, wood. There's Yeah, they have 10 wood now. Total. These guys are going out pretty far gathering flax, right? Nine? This guy's grabbing wood. All right, because I'm making a bow. So what happens is they go and gather whatever resource you need to make the bows themselves. You need to actually gather the resources, which you need flax. So, yeah, that's something to make the rope, I guess. Okay, let's head back in. We're going to grab our stuff. I don't know if there's any jump. I don't think there is. It's only roll currently. <laughs> this game is so nice. It is a lot. I mean, I can't believe the videos I saw of this game. I was fearing, because usually you'll see the videos, they go, oh yeah, it's really beautiful, and then you play the game, and you're like, eh, the game plays bad. This is actually a lot of fun already, this early on, especially they're gathering, getting yourself kind of organized, it's not just given to you. I kind of like that. And also getting a little bit of room to kind of learn the game. I don't know how fast these guys will expand, if it will be a big problem, if they will come and attack us. But uh, as they expand our territory, I bet you they'll want our land, of course. All right, let's go back in town here. 
and pick up uh, the TP what we can to craft up some more stuff for us. Okay, uh, we're going to put you away for now. You. Don't need that. Going to keep the medicine. And we're going to be grabbing some wood from here. Oh, they, they started crafting with it, that's why. Crap. They started crafting, didn't they? Yeah, they did. They have, like, when I craft that, I know it gives into social. Open this up here. I click on here. I think I can select what these guys will carry on them. Let's see here. If I grab this. Let's roll into town here. Click to open camp. Yeah, that's, I just opened up camp. I come not seeing the click that I want to. Okay, take that off. It's not giving me... Well, it's giving me the actual town. Okay, it's on up top. Sorry, I have to roll it up. Perfect. Okay, so put items. Upgrade the camp itself. Boar tusk we're going to need. Stag pelts. 20 of them. Buffalo pelts. We need 10 of those. Boar tusks. So we're going to need quite a bit to expand our camp. We can also settle back out a little further if you want to. You can bring us out here and settle here if you want to and bring this a little bit further out. Uh, but I think that's not the best idea, especially with only three warriors on us. I don't know if more come into camp or how that works out either. Uh, but yeah, that's not exactly what I want to do. Perfect. Let's click on this again. Roll up here, and right now we have gathering. All our warriors are out and about gathering, right? Do we have two more? All right, I want two more, and I want them to gather... Board test, but they, is there arrows or stuff they can use? Two weapons. Sorry, two warriors has weapons. All right, let's go and have that boar pelts. And I don't know if we can select the weapons. There's none here. Hunters need two more bows. All right, so we still need bows. All right, well, we're just going to let it be then. I'm just going to continue crafting and doing what they need to do. I definitely need more wood, dude. All right. Hopefully, they'll go out and get whatever they need out and about. Those guys were just kind of chillaxing anyways. Yeah, you guys were chillaxing. You know it. You know it. You guys are just chillaxing through this. All right, let's try and see if we can get the horse. I saw one. There's two of them, actually. Awesome. Let's jump on here. Ah, oh, so cool. All right, that should help us out for stamina issues. Oh, my goodness. Yes, sir, Bob. That is stunning. Very, very nice. These guys just show up out of nowhere. Do we get two more guys? All right, they got on a gathering. I think we're, we're starting to grow a tiny bit. I'm not positive. Uh, our 414 away is where we're supposed to go. The only thing I worry about that is that I might have to fight them. I don't think I have what it takes to fight right now. Uh, maybe we'll check to see if there's more arrows and stuff in here. I mean, to get this is a real pain in the butt. I don't know if the first day is a good idea to go out and about too far and fight. Uh, but let's go see if we got any more wood. I'll take that wood right now. There you go. Take that. Take that too. We got sinew and meat, which we wanted. That's good. And can I craft up some more arrows? craft itself no i only have three i might need to make myself another one like this afterwards though my bow itself i don't think my bow is going to last very long so let them go out and about and do their job it seems like everybody's out here getting wood i don't know if these guys get knocked down or getting killed because they're getting too close to camps or stuff is that possible because we did see a camp recently It's 300 over there. Damn it, I'm just too worried about that. Let's go this way and just investigate a little bit further. We can always find our way back here very easily. We're going to do that next episode. We get a tiny bit more resources. If you see anything right now, we're going to gather it. Again, it's always the first day. Try and get that built. Oh, got to be careful. Don't want to fall off the cliff or anything. Alright, we didn't get anything for hunting either last time. I think it's really just taking down those dudes. We'll have to find a whole mess of little sticks and wood and stuff. That'd be pretty darn amazing. See the dust from the animal? You can actually see it? That's pretty cool. 
This looks like a trail or something over here. Yeah, it does look like a trail, doesn't it? What is that? Oh, it's just flowers. Okay, they're just rendering in. Holy crap. Uh, pretty stable game, too. Do you guys realize how smooth this is right now? That's insane. You never have this in earlier access, usually. It's very rare. Very rare, but very nice. Okay, oh, some nice loot here. I don't think my horse follows me, so we'll have to keep... Uh, well, I'll have to keep sure that we're not going to lose him. We're going to have to make sure that we're a little bit out of the bounds. Let's just do this here. There we go. What was that exchange? Whoa, whoa, what was that? Harrison's Forest. Huh, it's not far away from here. We should go and check that out before the end. Let's see some civilization, I guess. I'm not sure. We'll grab you. We'll grab you because we're going to need to make ourselves a bow anyways. Going to need the flax, which I didn't know flax was using that. Definitely something I've just learned. I'm going to read a little more about that. It's pretty cool. Always learning something. All right. I'm not seeing too much more wood. Oh, I don't like that sound at all, dude. Did you guys hear that? That sounded like a wolf or something, didn't it? Like a coyote. Definitely easier to find a wood here for some reason. I found definitely a nice place to get some wood. Or something around here. I'm going to probably ride right past it. I heard the darn thing. I'd love to see what it looks like. In action. All right, let's just do this here. They've gone pretty far away. Look at that. This dude's like... He goes like very far away and then he ran back. Must have maybe a wolf or something. Pull him back. There's a trail here. Oh, crap. These guys have guns, dudes. How many arrows do we have? Not a ton, do we? All right, let's 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 see here. I want to test this out. I want to see what this game has to offer before we end this. And move on to the next episode. You know what I'm saying? I left my horse on a trail tonight. Yeah, yeah, good. Can I grab this, please? F. All right, wooden arrows. Craft. Craft. Sweet. Now I just have to worry about a bow. How many uh, do I need for a bow, just in case? I already have one, but I just need seven wood. Holy crap, dude. All right, I should be okay. One guy over there. You try for the guy in back. My accuracy sucks big time. Maybe go from behind. Just to make sure I don't forget where my horse is. Right there. Oops. My guy's walking right past this. I don't know if these guys are bad or not. But they got guns. Shit. Oh, damn, dude. He didn't see me. Taking quite a bit of arrows, dude. Are you down? This guy's just not even moving. There you go. Oh no! This guy was supposed to be. <laughs> oh no. Well, we'll take uh, we'll take all this stuff. <laughs> okay, maybe he was a nice guy. I don't know. I didn't really want to check it out and see. Oh wow, we got ourselves guns, dry fish and stuff. All right, that's cool. We could drag these guys. Oh, that's so awesome. And hide them. And here, drop. 
Very cool. Oh, I like that feature a lot. So I think this was actually a uh, <laughs> traitor. So he's gone now. Yep, we, uh, we've we killed him off. That was a great job game. I just a traitor right next to you, and you, you, you capped him. You taught him a lesson. A very, very good. Uh, Clifton Forest. All right. Well, we found out we could kill him. <laughs> I feel bad now, dude. I kind of feel bad. I mean, shit, you could have said something. <laughs> Didn't get the chance. The guy just stood there. I was like, what, dude? I'm supposed to help you. Okay. All right, well, let's get rid of this guy. This never happened. Okay, let's not talk about this. I guess early. We might... Uh, We'll, we'll test it out. We'll continue. I'm sure we'll find more of these guys. These guys are willing to trade for pelts and stuff. Pretty sure that's what he did. He was doing. He was trading for pelts. Could have made some coin. How do we get 300 friggin' SP though for that? To 150 SP. All right, let's say hang back to our horse. Let's see if we get lucky. Get a couple more sticks. It would be kind of sweet. I don't think my bow is going to last very long. Does it give you uh, how good your bow is left? It's, I mean, we have guns and stuff now, but... Inventory currently. Quality is low quality is six right now. Alright, so we've craft this baby up. We're gonna need some more wood, of course. Of course, always more wood. Everybody needs a little more wood. Alright, we'll go back to our horse. Now I feel super guilty. I just killed that dude for no reason. Alright, let's see if we can pick up a change to her. Oh look at there's a pistol. Let's load her up. I wish I could see it. She low loaded. All right. And then we have our Russell M1868. There you go. Looks like a shotgun. I don't know what the hell. Pretty cool, though. Yeah, it looks like a double barrel. <laughs> I don't know. Hard to see from this angle. All right. Some more hickory. Some more view. Any more stuff? This seems like a really good location to pick up stuff. And to meet traders and take them out for no apparent reason. That's right. First ever robbery. I want to get ourselves guns. Like I said, this land is our land. All right, let's head back. Let's go back to the village and see what we got. And we're going to do this. We're just going to double check to see our area, which is not where we're going. Their guys are going back. They're coming back with some wood. All right, we're going to right click here. And we'll be able to track that. Should have really walked up to him first. I didn't even want to die really fast. <laughs> oh, you got to appreciate it. All right, so the, the main one on the left-hand side. We're still going to need a whole lot more arrows and stuff. We do have, again, a gun, which would probably be helpful. I just don't know how much of a fight we're going to have on our hands on the other side and how that's going to work. I'm not sure if, even if there is going to be a fight this early on, but, again, it could happen. Entering Fort... Whoa, 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 whoa. Into Fort area. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, we don't want to go into Fort area just yet. Mr. Expansion there. All right, those trees, we can't do anything. All right, we've been through here. I remember this. Excuse me. Found some wood someone didn't grab on their way back. Lazy sons of beeswax. Yeah, I'm the one that's lazy. I'm going to kill people for no reason. Oh, God. I don't think you can jump with the horse. I know, not yet. Hopefully in the future, again, early, early access, right? More wood. Definitely easier than being on foot to look for this stuff. This area had some. Yeah, so it seems like it respawns. We were in this area not too long ago. It seems like it does respawn somewhat. Okay. Another one here. Right in front of us. Nice. So I should be able to craft up another bow here. See if the quality is any different in inventory. About the same. Holy crap, dude. Oh, don't worry about the trader. Take care of him. Don't go too close to that dough here, please. I don't want you to die. Simple bow. It doesn't tell me when it would break, though. Uh, two of them won't hurt. I'm overloaded. Carrying too much stuff, dude. You can't ride when you're overloaded. Are you freaking serious? How many did I make? 
Uh, Saxon pistol. I have that. Some dry fish. Which is health over one second. Which I don't think we have any problems with health. I wonder if that will just help me out to get back home. It does. Okay. No more goodies. We've grabbed more than we should. And it looks like you can't crawl. The bows are pretty heavy. All right, we're home. Sweet home. Everybody's kind of chillaxing near the fire. Very, very nice. I'm going to see if we can sleep tonight. Let's see what happens. Well, that sounds delicious, dude. Can I have some? All right, let's rest and see. All right, we're up and going. Looks like our, well, our, our people are out and about doing some stuff. They're all here. Holy crap, there's a lot of you. I should probably head you out and about to doing some more stuff. Um, all right, let's click on this. I have seven warriors, seven out of ten. And I don't think most of them have arrows, do we? It looks like we do. We've got arrows here inside the town. We could take ourselves maybe a couple. There we go. That would be a little easier. And then I can also put some of the stuff I have back. All right. We're also... It looks like they're doing a good job with the arrows. Are they making themselves some bows? I guess everybody's gathering themselves bows. Cancel order. Zero of 15 currently. We should tell me whether or not... To, I mean, there must be a way for us to find out who has what. Everywhere. 4.8. Huh. Interesting. All right. Um, all right. So upgrade camp is something we look at. Put items. We can put some items ourselves back in here. And put some dry fish, some eggs. There we go. Look like that. We can keep the medicine on us. Thank you very much. So smoked meat. You. I do have some little bit of wood. We have some flax too. We can drop that in there. They'll help them out. 19 wooden arrows. 35.8 pounds already of stuff on us. Those guns are heavy. We have three points to spend. Sangston. We have two wooden bows and both of them are 12 pounds each. How come I can't put one? I can put one back, but I don't know where the other one went. It should be my list here, but I got early access. Maybe it's just me or early access. I don't know. It's all good. All right. Let's see if we can get more gathering again one more time before we leave. Here, what we're going to do is gather. Zero one has a weapon. None of them have weapons. We still have no bows, right? They're still going full throttle and making arrows. I'm never going to reach it because I constantly do it. So we're going to do a cancel, cancel. I'm going to want 10. Let's do this here again. Cancel this out. I'm learning as we're going. At the camp, I'm going to want a wooden bows. So we're going to want bows. We're going to want wooden bows. Get uh, 10 to match out our, our warriors. Let's go 10. Confirm. All right. So I want you guys to craft that up. And then I want you guys to craft up some arrows. Wooden arrows afterwards. And I want uh, you guys to craft that up and get about 50 of those suckers. Confirm. All right, so we have 10 in stock. Right now, they have to start working on this. This is the main stay they're going to try and gather. If you tell them to do this, you only need to tell them to go and gather. They should go out and about, in theory, and go in to gather a whole bunch of stuff as they progress. Now, some people here will be crafting. Pretty sure some of them are crafting up what they need to be crafting. There's pelts and stuff. I'm not sure why they're doing that currently. Uh, but I guess to make the camp go, it's all good. And we can also tell some extra warriors to go out and do some work. Which is gather. Let's do four more. And help gather some wood. For everybody. We're going to need a lot of that. Send. Alright. Let's see if there's some people get up here. Alright. Some people are going to stay. Some people are going to go and do some work. Alright. That works out pretty good. So these guys are going out about and doing the work. And we've done our job extremely well. Did we lose one of our horses? I think we lost one of our horses. Did I park coming back? <laughs> what the hell did I do? 
pretty sure I came back with one of the horses. Anyways, it is what it is. Maybe he died. I have no idea. Uh, but we did an excellent job overall. So very, very proud. That's an awesome game, by the way. Uh, I'm very proud that I got a chance to play this. Thank you so much for that to the developers. And we're going to bring more of this. If you guys want to see more, take time and hit the like button. Love to see how this progresses and the fight that we're going to have to do. I can't wait to see a little more of the action. Thank you so much again. You guys are awesome. This game, I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Thank you.